say that it feels right. What's going on guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. Today I have gaming setup number two. Alright, let's get into it. First up, we go over here. What the heck is going on over here? Just got to turn the mic off real quick so they can't hear me. Alright, first up is the monitor. BenQ. Uh, this is a 28 or 27, I think it's 27 inch monitor. It's got like five millisecond, five millisecond response time. It's got two HDMI ports in the back, VGA and all that. All good. It's like top quality, high definition and like top range as it is. It's very good, does the job. And that goes down and connects down to the beautiful, the Xbox One down here. Does the job very well. And one of the main things I love about this is backwards compatibility. It's bringing out um, Black Ops 2. I'm pretty sure it's coming within 10 days of me uploading this video to backwards compatibility. It's going to be insane. And that brings us to the second monitor over here. It's just a casual Dell. This is what I used to be playing on, but then I upgraded to this. So this is just for the PC now, which is new, as you can see. Got the, the good old Smith dogs here. And if we go down to the Elgato, we can see that's what I used to record here. Can flash back to previous times and go back live, you know. I'm also working on like a little overlay here, as you can see, but that'll be later. We'll quickly go down to the channel. 2.37 at the time of recording this. And my goal is to hit, oh, sorry about the shakiness. My goal is to hit 250 by the time this video gets like 150 views because I know this video will get a fair few views because the last one did. I'm going to aim for 30 likes as well. So make sure you smack the thumbs up button and yeah. And so that brings us to the keyboard down here which is just a standard wireless keyboard, you know, does the job well. Brings us to the mice which is also wireless, came with that. Very nice, works well with that. All right. We, we might have to turn this bloke down here. Here's the uh, the headset. Oh, yeah. He's cooked. He is cooked. Alright. Turtle Beach. Stealth 420X. Wireless. Very nice is what I used to talk to my friends on the mic. Very good. Good quality headphones. They just chill there when I'm not using them. Brings us over to the other mic, which is the Blue Snowball. This is what I use to record my voice in my videos, but obviously it hasn't been working very well lately, so... Now I've got it all set though, because obviously I was using it on my Mac before, but now because I'm running it through my PC, everything is just beautiful and clear, and it's just working a lot better through here. So expect better mic quality, sorry for the bad mic quality lately, but yeah. That's going to be good. So the mic and that connects down to the... The PC, which is down in the forbidden land, <coughs> with the screech noise every time. As you can see, just standard Intel i7 processor, you know, very fast. Doesn't have the best graphics card, but that's because I'm doing all my gaming on here anyway, so I just have this pretty much just for nice, fast editing and all that stuff while I'm on the PC. I may as well show you guys what I'm using to edit. Like before I got the PC, I was using iMovie to edit. Very good program, very, it was free on the Mac and it just did everything that I needed. But now, obviously, can't get iMovie on this, so we've moved over to another program called DaVinci Resolve. Now, as you can see here, it looks very standard, but really, this is an extremely advanced free program. It's absolutely insane, it has insane color correcting and all this stuff, which, like, I'll probably never use, but like if I do make an insane video, I've got the ability to do it, so that's very nice. So I also have um, Photoshop down here, as you can see. I got that with school. School gives it to you for free, which is great, so yeah, and obviously runs a lot faster. And there's all my Prez VFs thumbnails that I've kind of made there. Obviously, I'm starting to make thumbnails now, like before, I didn't have the ability to really make good thumbnails. But now, thumbnails are coming more frequently. Okay. 
let's go down here again and as you can see up here that cord connects that connects the, the Xbox goes down here and actually connects into the Elgato itself this is the HD 60 sorry it's a bit blurry down here not much lighting but uh, that connects into that and then this runs into the console and this runs into the computer very simple to use Sorry about the wires down here. It's a lot better than it was, believe it or not, because I used whoops that daisy. I used to have the LED lighting in here, but like that's four more wires and I really don't need that. So anyway, down here is the Wi-Fi modem. Like this got it plugged in there. Those two, that's for the Xbox, that's for the PC. So very nice down there. And the chair, of course, the, the one and only DX Racer. Blue racing series. Got the cushion there and the cushion there. Very nice. Uh, just an overall great chair. Goes up and down, you know. Don't know what's going on with that strap there, but it's a very good chair. Very good back support. Very good buy. And that's pretty much. Actually, no, we'll come over here quickly. Control Freak. Uh, I only really need one for the, the aiming on Call of Duty. And this is pretty much just like a scuff for twenty dollars. Like it does, it just makes you jump by pressing that. It's it's just so easy. It's like I recommend just getting a control freak over a scuff. It's literally just better quality, and like yeah, you don't have to worry about like trigger stops and for different games and everything. It's just yeah, great. Oh, also the controller here starting to wear. Actually, that's my plain charge kit I've got plugged in there. Um, I've had this for a year and a half probably now. It's a very trustworthy controller, Halo Master Chief Collection it was. But as you can see here, maybe, it's starting to rip a little bit. If I bring it over here, you can see there's, it's the ripping a bit. It's very annoying, I'm going to have to get a new one soon. But otherwise that's a very good controller for me. And that's pretty much all over here, I think. So, down here just got the shoes, ball, bag. Oh, look at this new addition right here. Good old crocodile. Oh, mate. And that brings us over here to the good old figures. Got these for Christmas. Wasn't really expecting it. These are all Call of Duty. Uh, bl oh, Black Ops 1, I think. That's just a zombie. I honestly don't know. I know he's very well known. And that's from COD Ghost, obviously. Here's the camera that I used to record the last video. But I've decided to go to iPhone 6s. Look here, we got the, we got the good old TV playing, the Auckland Nines. Storm just couldn't see it as a try. <sighs> chips, you know you never get hot ch like chips are just t too difficult these days. They're either hot or they're cold. I want them warm. I'm inventing warm chips, guys. It's coming soon. I'm telling you. And fan, it's pretty hot lately. It's me. Bed. Docking station, yep. Oh, one other thing. Phone. This is really dirty, look at this. So the phone is obviously charging here, as you guys can see. You know, charging. And that goes in here, down here, through here and down to the power point, which is like in there. Like that is extremely filthy and there's like only that little cord there you can see. You just pick it up, you know, look at this. Slides across, look at that, that is, Extremely dirty right there. As you can see, it was jailbroken. Okay, look at this. There's an option here to turn your data on and off. As you can see, it's all in one page as well, which is great. And it's just so many good things about this that, look, if I just hold down on this, it takes me to my last app. How good is that? So many cool things that you can do and so many plus sides of jailbreaking these days. And look at that, Nike. Nike approved and oh look at that blue battery. Ooh, ooh. That's enough of that. Come over to the uh one thing I think I haven't mentioned is the uh look at old mouse pad. It's very long here. Hmm. <laughs> Razor, Galatheus or whatever. Very nice. Mouse pad does make just like without that mouse pad there. It's just, you know, it's not the same. So beautiful mouse pad. And I want to try and upgrade my keyboard to the same Razer, but it's a bit expensive. So yeah, otherwise, I think I've covered everything. Unfortunately, the Storm just lost. They were up 16, 
15 against the Roosters and they lost. Oh, look. Oh, yes. Ready? Oh, oh my goodness. All right. I think I covered everything except this couple of stickers here, you know, sticker collection. Cheeky little uh, Bart Simpson. And yeah, that is it. So if you guys enjoyed today's video, please don't forget to like, subscribe. I'm on the road to 250 subs. I want to make it there soon. I like, I'm on 237 right now. I only need 13 more. And I guarantee there's 13 new people watching this video. So if you guys could please subscribe, like the video, check out all the other videos on the channel. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.